Hi, I'm Dave Oates, Head Researcher at Finder Monkey. This is day two of our 10 day Facebook Live challenge to answer as many of your questions as we can. Uh, we've got another question today which comes in from uh, Mike Watson, so I'll just have a I'll read it out to you. Uh, Somewhere out there in the big wide world, I have or had a brother I've never seen. We were separated in 1944 after our mother left us alone in a house in Hoxton, London. My grandfather took me in but couldn't take him as well as, as he was still only six months old and I was four. He, uh, he had had children of his own to, to keep and look after. I have his birth certificate endorsed, adopted but no date. A part, a part of me is missing. Both our parents have passed away. So, I mean, the good news is for Mike that you, there, is a, there is a path for you to, to try and find, find your brother and find out what became of him. Um, hopefully, you know, he is still living, but um, there will be a way to find him. Unfortunately, it's not something that people can do on their own. Um, so, while there is a pathway to find an adopted person, it's not something that, that you can do as an individual. You have to seek the help of a, a registered intermediary. Um, for England and Wales, what that means is a, an adoption support agency usually. Um, also, you can contact the local authority where you live um, and they will, they potentially can help you. It, it varies depending on the local authorities to how much help you can actually get because uh, it's quite an expensive process and many local authorities these days won't have um, the funding available to help you do it. So it just depends where you go and what response you will get. But there are independent agencies out there um, charities that also do the same kind of work so there's a few different areas and places you can go to for help but it's not something you can access the reason for that is an adopted person's records are very much closed and are not accessible to anybody other than registered agencies um, who are registered as an adoption support agency with Ofsted so um, that is work that we do in conjunction with um, uh, Joanna North Associates who are an Ofsted registered adoption support agency registered to carry out intermediary work so if you did want help it is something that you know we'd be happy to speak to you about and see if we could uh, we could help but there are several ways it can be done but unlike yesterday's it's not something that you can do yourself because the records are, are still closed hope that answers your question mike and i look forward to receiving more questions tomorrow